The revitalization of Union Station began nine years ago and it still isn't finished. Originally it was supposed to be done in 2015, but that date keeps getting pushed back and the price tag pushed up. The consensus is that the improvements and expansion to Union Station will be worth it in the end, but in the meantime, it can be a confusing experience for users. I just arrived um, by train from Windsor and I'm seeing four different signs for the subway pointing in different directions. One right here behind me points outside, there's another one over here that points that way, and this one points downstairs. Yeah. So. Well, we just got here from Brazil. Oh yes. Uh, so uh, we w we went here. So we got to this dead end, and uh, we we didn't know what it was supposed to do. What are you actually looking for? Yeah, uh, to line one subway. Why do you just say that? Because I was just trying to get from Longos in Brookfield Place to here. And even though I know everything, I still got turned around. Right. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, a little pain for a lot of gain. <laughs> The gain will be new and improved concourses, new retail space and restaurants, and restoration of the building's historic features. But the cost has ballooned. The original price tag was $640 million. That number jumped to $800 million with the timeline pushed back to 2018. But in January, a City of Toronto report revealed that the price tag would actually be $823 million. Doing any kinds of renovation in a historic building like this uh, takes time, it takes money, it takes patience um, and you find things out while you're doing the renovations that you hadn't anticipated because it's so old so you find out old wiring all kinds of old things so it's the doing construction here is challenging at the best of times contract disputes have also been contributing factors to the project's cost overruns and delays Union Station is considered Canada's busiest transit hub, serving 65 million customers a year. And that number is expected to almost double by 2031. The next projected completion date for the project is the end of 2018. At Union, I'm Pam Seedle, City News.